The entire 13 News Now team is tracking the storm. We're looking into how emergency officials are preparing. The Department of Emergency Management met today before the storm system moved in. Allison Basil explains their top concerns tonight. As Hampton Roads prepares for another round of snow. The Virginia Department of Emergency Management is focusing on the eastern shore. We are ready positioned. Gusty winds and heavier snowfall are expected to hit this area the hardest. A different combination from what the 757 experienced last weekend. This time around, it's a different composition of snow. So the weight of it can really bring down tree branches, those big limbs and power lines. Any gusts higher than 40 miles per hour start to shut down the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel. So VDEM spokeswoman Katie Carter says 15 airmen from the Virginia National Guard are already in place there. They're staged right there in anticipation of a potential bridge closing so that that area is not cut off from resources. She says they have vehicles that can tackle heavy snow and chainsaws for any debris. The area is not necessarily equipped to deal with several inches of snow. Once the storm settles, Carter says the guard can move anywhere in a flash. Additional guardsmen that could be deployed pretty quickly in the event that they do need to be at Hampton Roads region. On the Eastern Shore, Allison Basil, 13 News Now. Now this is the fourth time this month the Virginia Department of Emergency Management and the National Guard have helped with snowfall across the state. Officials say the governor's emergency declaration gives them extra funding.